Glory to God the Father and Son Yeshua Messiah. Proverbs chapter 6. Avoid surety. My son, if you have put up security for your friend, if you committed yourself on behalf of another, you have been snared by the words of your mouth, caught by the words of your own mouth. Do this now, my son, and extricate yourself. Since you put yourself in your friend's power, go, humble yourself, and pester your friend. Give your eyes no sleep, give your eyelids no rest. Break free, like a gazelle from the hunter's trap, like a bird from the grip of the fowler. Do not be a sluggard. Go to the ant, you lazy bones, consider its ways, and be wise. It has no chief, overseer or ruler. Yet it provides its food in summer and gathers its supplies at harvest time. Lazy bones, how long will you lie there in bed? When will you get up from your sleep? I'll just lie here a bit, rest a little longer, just fold my hands for a little more sleep. And poverty comes marching in on you, Scarcity hits you like an invading soldier. A scoundrel, a vicious man, lives by crooked speech. Winking his eyes, shuffling his feet, pointing with his fingers. With deceit in his heart, he is always plotting evil and sowing discord. Therefore disaster suddenly overcomes him. Unexpectedly, he is broken beyond repair. There are six things Adonai hates, seven which he detests. A haughty look, a lying tongue, hands that shed innocent blood. A heart that plots wicked schemes, feet swift in running to do evil. A false witness who lies with every breath, and him who sows strife among brothers. Do not commit adultery. My son, obey your father's command, and don't abandon your mother's teaching. Bind them always on your heart, tie them around your neck. When you walk, they will lead you. When you lie down, they will watch over you. And when you wake up, they will talk with you. For the mitzvah is a lamp, Torah is light, and reproofs that discipline are the way to life. They keep you from an evil woman, from a loose woman's seductive tongue. Don't let your heart lust after her beauty or allow her glance to captivate you. The price of a whore is a loaf of bread, but the adulteress is hunting for a precious life. Can a man carry fire inside his shirt without burning his clothes? Can a man walk, barefoot, on hot coals without scorching his feet? So is he who has sex with his neighbor's wife. Anyone touching her will be punished. A thief is not despised if he steals only to satisfy his appetite when hungry. But even he, if caught, must pay back sevenfold. He may have to give up all the wealth that he owns. He who commits adultery lacks sense. He who does it destroys himself. He will get nothing but blows and contempt, and his disgrace will not be wiped away. For jealousy drives a man into a rage. He will show no mercy when he takes revenge. He will not accept compensation. He'll refuse every bribe, no matter how large.